Also new tonight, a man watching television is shot and killed. His family says by stray bullets that came right through the front door. We covered it on the night team was breaking news Wednesday night in the California neighborhood. Now his family is sitting down with WHS 11 night teams Taylor Woods and photojournalist Elijah McKenzie talking about what they saw. Get ready to eat. As soon as I set the pizza down, I heard bam, bam. You can see the damage from two bullets is clearly in the front door. Family members here on Grand Avenue say they were two stray bullets that hit and killed 52-year-old Robert William Crossan. He was at home watching old Michael Jordan basketball highlights on TV with his uncle, D. Wayne D. Berry. D. Berry immediately ran to the front room after hearing the shots. He was already gone. What nothing I could do. I could look at him and tell he was dead. D. Barry believes the shooting was not targeted and the bullets randomly came through the home and killed his nephew. He says police told him the shots were fired from a very far distance. They said to the dog, the shots that came from down that way, because they came over that same night and they was looking around, there wasn't no shell casings or nothing on her. He says he and Crossan had a bond like no other. They grew up with each other and always laughed and made jokes. He was like my little brother. Cause he wasn't number like 10 years younger than me, you know. You know, I just feel like, you know, that's, you know, my brother's gone. D. Barry says Wednesday night's tragedy still doesn't make sense. He doesn't know who fired the bullets, but he's holding his nephew's memories tight. Well, we, we used to have some heck of a debates, man, you know. Talking about sports and stuff, we be, be debating, being almost arguing. He and other family members are looking for justice in this case. So he just was in the wrong spot at the wrong time, and I guess the Lord was ready for him to come home. As they look to lay him to rest soon in Louisville, Taylor Woods, WHAS 1119 on your side.